Okay, this is what you need to do. This is my main water line coming out of the bottom of the trailer. Put you a cut off there. Come above that. This is one inch line. Do a one inch check valve for your water. Come up, put you a T, reduce down to three quarter. This is your bypass line. You need 25 foot of this. It runs under my trailer and comes back in right here in the pump. Uh, once you put that on, come up above that, put you another T. That T is gonna be your main water line. This is my metering valve. That main water line comes over after you tee off that, well, this is my bleach. So this goes down to my bleach tank. That goes to my 12 volt uh, shutoff valve. So on top of that main water line, this is where you put your tee for your metering valve. And then up here is gonna be your main water line coming into your pump. So this is basically what you need to know. Come off the bottom, put your cut off, one inch check valve, so your bleach don't go back in your water. Come up to a three quarter inch uh, or one inch T reduced down to three quarter inch for your bypass hose. Come up with another T. This is your main soap line, your bleach. That's my one inch medium valve. Come down. I put a union in it cause it's easier to take off. Uh, sometimes you need to take them off. Put your check valve so your bleach or your water don't go in your bleach. And then if you want to do it like I did, that's a 12 volt cutoff valve. It goes up, goes over into my bleach tank. And then again, this is your main water line coming in here. Make sure, remember this now, make sure your three quarter inch bypass hose is coming up before your bleach. If you get those backwards, all you're going to do is bypass bleach. So make sure you remember that. Hope this helps you, bud.